let's go um reddit today uh see what's going on then go after reddit we'll go somewhere else where do we go i have no idea philandering scrub thanks to the four I'll months stream man. A punk. boggies <clears throat> Okay, let's go boys. Today is gonna be a good day. I can feel it. I can feel it actually. I feel pretty well rested actually. It's all good. Spectre Arcana colored. Ooh. Pretty hot. That's pretty hot, dude. Non-vegetarian Sven cosplay. Is this even safe for work, dude? What the fuck is this? Chicken, okay. Jesus, that's a cursed fucking cosplay. Who would put a chicken on your face, like a raw chicken on your face? This guy has fucking got like some fucking diseases now after his cosplay. Shit. <laughs> okay then. I need to lower music a little bit, right? That's fine. Three months in, I think I'm addicted to this game. What is this? Is this the bacon egg thing? Potatoes? Clarity? Okay. So, right, I'm trying to get what the fuck is going on. Tango, mango. Okay, so this is a mango. Today's menu is Dota 2. Three years, Pog. Keep up the good work, my man. Much love from Canada less than three. Thanks for the three years, Superfix. A lot of two, three years, there's not today too. Damn. Okay, so this is the ages, I see. This is a drama of endurance. All right, these are iron branches. Iron branches look really legit, to be honest. I like those. Uh, and this is... This can't taste good. I refuse to believe that whatever this is down here... Whatever the fuck this is, this cannot taste good. This is this food? Is this supposed to be food? Are you telling me this food? Come on, this can't taste good. What the fuck is this blue shit? Now the other ones I don't mind. I think this might be taste taste pretty good, right? That that looks good too. This I mean you know can't go wrong with bacon and potatoes or whatever that is. I guess I don't know. No ribs and potatoes I guess. There's a mango. I mean mango is mango. Clarity. All right. Cool. I suppose. I miss the old side shops. Me too. That I think they're coming back for the patch, guys. I have a feeling. I have a feeling they're gonna release them again. It's coming. I don't know why. I just feel it. Mm. Creek mm -hmm. said the carry player mm -hmm. streams is like watching a WoW PVE stream. What you have to say about that? I watch this stream for the pogs. I watch Creek for the Omega pogs. <laughs> Thanks. I was really funny watching. Supports Ward when they have their maps covered. <laughs> That's funny. That's good content, right? That's even better. That's fucking content right there, dude. What do you mean? Uh, Kyo. And what's wrong with WoW? Nothing wrong with WoW. An older brother taught me how to play Dota. He picked Lion in the first game. I don't remember what I picked, but I remember... He just picked at me at level 6. I was really mad at him. You know, Lion has a finger of death, which really has high damage. He killed me once and he bought Dagon in Dota 1. Dagon and finger of death had the same animation. I was like, dude, bro, you're cheating. I was so mad. I remember the Would same. Would you play more horror games like you did lately? I will be more than happy to see it. Jurassic World 10 months. Yeah, I mean, we're planning on playing some variety now before patch. I don't know when patch is coming, so I'm stalling, kinda, but... I will be playing some variety soon enough, I believe. Uh, speaking of, I remember when I was playing, I think it was Dota 1, I thought also the Dagon was the most broken thing, actually. I, I thought, uh, I played against Lina with Dagon and Laguna Blade, I thought it was the most broken thing. I thought it was unplayable. How do you beat this, man? Fucking like true story right there. Iceberg explanation, uh, Wu sends this to three months. Hey. About the exp I saw explanation about not removing techies in 2005. Noob's crying part was hilarious. He was not moved because he was imbalanced. He wasn't. He was also not moved due to noob's crying, the way you put it. Most of the people had a say in him being moved were highly skilled, recognized players in the community. He was moved instead of removed completely because there are still techies lovers. Techies lovers? Imagine being a techies lover. What the hell? I would consider a no fuck mode that some of you guys suggested for a future version. I don't think he was or is strong. Techies, wow, okay, sure. Oh, Clinks, I see. A hero with 27 abilities should be placed in this type of tavern to begin with. Let me guess, you consider yourself a child of good. 
Doing that job, thanks to the tier one sub, man. Appreciate it, dude. Ugh. Thank you, Val, for Nemesis. Regular Dota 2 actually seems fucking fun now that I've played Nemesis. Dude, what is even Nemesis? I I I played it for like half uh, half a game the first day. Then after that, I don't know, dude. Where what is Nemesis? I don't fucking know. I know all I know it's bad. <laughs> Mm -mm. Imagine if this happened in a pro game. Still in beta, I guess. What happened? Pay attention to the left side TP gold. He didn't die somehow? Hmm. No gold. Hmm. Yeah, that's strange. That's, that's a mystery right there. That's weird. I guess. Hoodwink's progression through his patch. DPC leak. I hated Hoodwink during DPC leak. My team was like, ah, please, let me pick it. No, I said, no. Fuck you guys. I thought it was terrible. But, I guess I was wrong, maybe. Because it was 4% pick rate, 38% win rate. It was garbage. Then Animator, 10% pick rate, 78% win rate. But this is so little pick rate that the win rate isn't really accurate, I think. Like, it's, it's only 10% of games. 14 games, 78% win rate. It won 10 out of 14 games or something, right? And then we have Essel Summer. They picked it in 26% games. That's more accurate. 44%. Tier 10 qualifiers. 50%. 53%. Okay. Picked in 40% of games. That's so many picks on Hoodwink. Holy shit. I mean, it's an, uh, the reason people picked it because I think it's that little strong lane, right? You pick like Mars Hoodwink and there's almost nothing that can beat you. It's accurate, I will debate you to the nebula, nebula on that. You, know, you guys know me, I like debating into the nebula. I do it every fucking day with myself about the tournament organizers. I must be good, good at Dota, crossbows from poker. I've been playing for nine years, you must be really good, right? You must be really good, right? Yeah. Poker is a bitch game, dude. Poker is a bitch game. You can play a lot of years, but you can still be worse than some fucking 19 year old that... That fucking has no cares and also is pretty smart, right? He'll fucking not care about you, dude. Poke, uh, post game alignment chart. Look at caption. Yeah, I saw it. I mean, this caption? This face? I don't know what this face is. What the fuck is this face? I've never seen it in my life. Post game alignment chart. Okay. Lawful good, GG well played. Neutral good, GG. Chaotic good, G. Damn, G is toxic, man. Come on. Lawful neutral, GG Whipley. Poor, poor X player on losing team that did the best. That's neutral? What? That's Omega toxic. What are you talking about? I'm already... What the fuck is this post? I say, good game, well played. Poor Spectre. Your entire team fucking sucked. That's toxic. What is this post? Your neutral says nothing, sure. Chaotic neutral says GG easy. I wanna say that's neutral. Lawful evil GG Whipley. Shame about X player on losing team. Dude, this is just as toxic as the other one. It's no difference. <laughs> neutral evil BG. BG isn't evil. Oh my god, this guy is terrible, dude. Chaotic evil GG after winning. Oh, this one after losing. Okay, fine. The fuck? Worst post ever. BG isn't toxic. You can say BG if it was a bad game, you know? BG for Bulgaria. I don't know. I say GG easy when I lose. Yeah, that's... I guess that's chaotic chaotic neutral. I don't even know what to, how to respond to that. I like the question mark after killing someone. Well, you are just chaotic evil, brother. Well, actually, probably neutral evil, I guess. Is, um... Today the winning day? Nah, you look at the title, man. It's losing day. I say easy plus the lane where I played. That's a good one. Easy mid lane. Even if you lose. And you just you got away with a little bit of a win. Yeah, easy mid lane. Fuck you. Okay, that's too, too dank. Holy shit, it's Ignis. I have no idea what this is. I just see them having the Pogu face. This looks like a young gyrocopter. Look at him go. I don't know what the fuck this ogre is. Looks like the rock almost. I don't even know. I don't have the Pogu phase anymore. Sorry, chat. Dazzler fan art. Cool. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Cool. Most satisfying hero to kill. For me, killing a Tinker in any stage of the game is most satisfying. True. I guess. Giant Morphling, insta-killing will be very satisfying as it counters most of my heroes. Yeah, Morph is pretty good to kill. Huskar, killing Huskar. I can agree with these three. They're actually very... What other hero is very nice to kill? Uh, Techies? Yeah, Techies is nice. I don't know what else. Hoodwink. Ugh, she runs into the tree and you just grab her and you're just like, Fuck you, motherfucking squirrel, piece of shit. Fuck all the furries, too. <laughs> That's how I feel. Alright. Brood? Oh yeah, Brood, same thing. True. Okay. We should all just give her a nice squeeze when she comes how about, in. How do I squeeze her though? I mean, Making her like that. Oh, 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 oh that's so weird. Yeah, <laughs>